That's a very interesting dynamic now because since September, the English team are professional and obviously the Irish team are not. Did the, did the players notice a difference on Friday coming up against professionals? Yeah, I think obviously, you know, we were gutted to lose and speaking to the girls afterwards, I think it was the intensity that, that England came with for the whole 80 minutes. It's not, you know, it's very different to the guys' game. It's not, we're not, you know, as big and powerful. Mm. So it was the, the nature of the intensity for the whole lot of it was, was, um, was something that they the girls said afterwards that just, you know, you could live with for a certain amount of time. And, and in fairness, you know, to England, they took their chances when they came. But yeah. Um, yeah, look, we, we said coming into this campaign, we're like the other countries. England is the only professional entity and we were never going to use it as an excuse and we haven't mm. um, and, and we won't. Be it will be a difficult bridge to, to uh, gap. It will be a difficult gap to bridge. There we go. You got yeah. that. It will be a difficult... Uh, There's a bridge. <laughs> There's a bridge. <laughs> There's a gap. <laughs> There's a bridge and a gap, and something has to be done in between. So just throw them over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't uh, bring the chicken and you can't bring the corn together. So you have to go back to the fox. The vicious. It's tricky. Uh, it will be difficult though because you're. I'm just glossing by all that. Yeah. Uh, you know, so you have to you train in the morning yep. or you train in the evening, and you, you have to go and be a guard around Limerick. Whereas yep. Dunnock is lying on a couch all day resting. Watching Kong Town. Don't forget that. <laughs> And what and are your favourite shows? Uh, and some beds, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Easy, no. <laughs> <laughs> we made a line so tight. Let's stick to it. Um, yeah, look, it's, it's, it, but it's all we've known. So we can't turn around and say, oh, I'd love to be off. Sure. Um, th you know what I mean? I, when, when we work, so say I work six days on, four days off. On the four days off, if I'm idle, I don't really know what to do with myself. You've grown up in that era where, you know, they've always been professional. So it was something for us. I like the fact that my days are structured and routine. I right. get up, I go to the gym in the morning, I go to work, go back to, to train in whatever session it is, and I go to bed, like, basically. And, yeah. um, and speaking to some of the English girls as well after the game, they found that really difficult, that transition to be, you know, having been so busy all the time to now not having much to do. Mm. It's, I'm not saying that it's, look, we'd all love to be professional, but I'm just saying that it's a different mindset. Yeah. It's got a transition.